nuclear fusion powers the sun, atom bombs, and may one day generate electricity. It happens when the nuclei of two atoms fuse to make a heavier nucleus, releasing a lot of energy. But because nuclei have a positive charge, the electrostatic force pushes them apart, and getting them close enough to fuse is like climbing an increasingly steep hill. But if you get them 100,000 times closer than the width of an atom, an even stronger force takes over, the strong nuclear force. As the strongest force in the universe, it pulls the nuclei together so violently that they lose some of their mass during the collision, so that the mass of the two nuclei before fusion is greater than the mass after fusion. So what happens to the lost mass? Well, E equals mc squared says that a small amount of mass contains a huge amount of energy. So it's this missing mass which is released as energy. For example, when one kilogram of hydrogen fuses into helium, about seven grams of mass is converted to energy. Using E equals mc squared, this equals about 600 gigajoules of energy, about 42 Hiroshima bombs, give or take. But how exactly does fusion work in stars like our sun? Well, watch the next video to find out.